Hong Kong Immigration Department Form ID 990A is used by an applicant to initiate an application for an employment visa, for admission under the immigration arrangements for non-local graduates, and for the admission of mainland talents and professionals. Each of these visa types fall under the rubric of employment as a professional under the general employment policy, and the form is used where the applicant is physically outside of Hong Kong on the date the application is submitted to the Hong Kong Immigration Department. The form itself is relatively straightforward to complete, with only the sections discussing proposed period of stay, accompanying family members, if any, qualifications, employment record and declarations, requiring an examination in detail. The rest of the form is all very self-explanatory. For part two of the form, which covers the proposed stay in Hong Kong for employment, the proposed date of entry is best demarcated as being at least one month hence but ideally three to four months, in order to give the Hong Kong Immigration Department the time they need to finalise the visa consideration processes. And for the proposed duration of stay, if you've got no fixed time for the future, you can simply state, indefinite, at your discretion. If some or all of your family members are accompanying you during your stay for employment in Hong Kong, you complete this section of the form to have them joined as a party to your application. They'll be granted dependent visas assuming that they qualify as your legal dependents and the period of stay they receive will mirror yours as the principal applicant exactly. There are four discrete sections on the form ID 990A which speak to your qualifications and prior employment record. It's vital that the information you provide in these sections of the form dovetail perfectly into the information detailed on the CV, which we recommend you include as standard in your application, so check the details carefully. Sections 5 and 6 are very straightforward. However, Section 4 is designed to identify those applicants who qualify for liberalised visa consideration treatment under the Immigration Arrangements for Non-Local Graduates. So, if you've not previously or recently graduated from a Hong Kong Tertiary Education Institute, please strike this section through marking it as not applicable. And on the form, there are three areas to declare the truthfulness, correctness and completeness of the information you've submitted in pursuit of your application. And these are at the bottom of each page of the form, in respect of any dependents joining in the application, and at the end by the principal applicant, him or herself. 